This video is about error too many redirects which occurs on Google Chrome. Uh, it indicates that the site you are trying to visit is redirecting you somewhere else which is further redirecting you to somewhere else and in result a, re in a redirect loop that prevents you from opening the page. This error is usually originating on the site server which you are visiting not on the uh, not on the user end. However, in some cases, if cookies are stored or if DNS has cached the data while the server has changed its configuration, the error can be triggered. We can make sure the problem doesn't lie with your end by performing some checks, uh, such as clearing cookies, testing in incognito mode, etc. If after performing these checks, the website still doesn't load up, it means the error isn't on your site. It lies with the server side and there is nothing wrong with your computer. This error wouldn't be resolved unless some steps are taken from the server side. The first step is to test with other browsers. The error, error too many redirects can be specific to your browser. We can check this fact by opening the website with another one. Just use another device or browser and try navigating to the exact same site. If it opens there and doesn't open on your computer, we can try troubleshooting the browser by clearing cache. If the problem occurs in the device browsers in the device or other browser too, it means the problem is with the server and you as an end user can do nothing until the problem is fixed at the server end. If the problem only lies with um, your computer, we can try clearing your browser data. Your browser may contain fault files which may be causing the problem. When we clear the browser data, everything gets restart, reset and browser behaves like you are visiting the website for the first time. If you are using Google Chrome, open a Chrome session, type chrome colon backslash forward slash forward slash settings. Navigate to the bottom of this page and click on advanced. In the advanced, under the section of privacy and security, under the section of privacy and security, click on clear browsing data. From here, click all time. Choose everything um, in the options and then clear the data. Now restart your browser by just close this browser, go to task manager and kill all the processes related to your browser and then restart it. Now check if the website is accessible again. The another thing that we can check is the extensions. If clearing the browsing data doesn't work for you, we can check if browser extensions are making a problem. You should always disable those extensions which you think can be causing a problem. We still recommend that you disable all the extensions from the browser before moving on to the next step to determine whether the problem lies in your browser or the server. To check your browser extension on Chrome, open a Chrome session. In the address bar, type Chrome colon forward slash forward slash extensions and hit enter. Now check all the extensions and just toggle it to disable all the extension. We recommend to disable all extension and check if the problem still persists. The next thing we can check is to make sure the date and time settings are fine. Press Windows and S key. Type settings. Open the settings. Click on time and date setting. Uncheck the option. First, check if the date and time are correct. If not, just turn off the automatic settings then click change button to correct the date and time once done
check if the problem still persist. If all these steps have been performed and you're still experiencing the issue, it means that the problem lies with the server side and there's, there isn't anything you can do about it being an end user. If your browser was still unable to open the website even after all the method explained, there is nothing you can do. However, if you think that the problem lies only with your computer and everyone else is able to access the address, you should contact support to diagnose what the problem might be. I hope this video will be helpful for you. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe our channel.